Do 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 do. Hey, good morning. We're live. It's five fifty nine a.m. on a. Oh, that's my glasses. I don't know. Could be the camera. It's kind of hot, humid here in Philadelphia, and this is the five a.m. Master Scrum Show. And I hope all is well with everybody around the world. I'm gonna clean that off a little bit. Eh, a little better. A little steamy, hot, humid here. So maybe the camera lens got a little. See me. Um, I'm Craig Master, Scrum Master, and Agile Coach. And here in the 5 a.m. Master Scrum Show, we uh, talk about Scrum and Agile in a practical and tactical sense and uh, help you get your value to the customer in such a way that you get home to your family and friends at a decent time and, and uh, a different, decent pace, not working 60, 80 hours a week, working in a lean fashion. And we have a little fun as we do it. So, it is Sunday morning, and it's now 6 a.m., so it's kind of early here. Uh, I have a topic, a little short one. I put the kind of the title, No Scrum on Fridays, in the, uh, in the topic area, and uh, I'm probably get everybody all, what do you mean no scrum on Fridays? Did on purpose. Sucker. Got you in there. Um. And the idea being is that, you know, we all want to have fun in our lives. We want to balance things up. And so many people are so, I'm getting to what I'm talking about, so tight on doing everything exactly the way the book says. Here's my thought. On Fridays, especially with a lot of teams that are not co-located, um, if you are co-located, it doesn't really matter as much. But if you have people like like a lot of my teams are here in the States, got people in India, Europe, Australia, it's just all over the planet, right? And a lot of those, um, even though we're starting here early on Friday mornings, a lot of the, the partners and teammates on my teams are done or at the end of their day on Fridays. Now, for some odd, weird reason, there are people in this world who don't think anybody else enjoys their Friday evenings. I don't know. They just think, we're going to work. We're going to work late to Friday night. And I like look at people and I go, I'm pretty sure I've been around the world. Everybody enjoys their Friday nights. Um, Most people take our Saturdays and Sundays are considered a weekend on their calendars. And they have time off and they, they do like to go home early to their family and friends because guess what? They're no different than anybody else. And they all look at me like they're not. And I go, you're so full of it. So what I propose is on Fridays, instead of doing a daily stand up in the morning, I propose if you have a system like Slack matter most teams whatever is a continuous chat solution that you no longer you offer it up to the teams because right? you don't want you know, ask them you know is it okay if we we do daily scrum via slack or via teams where um a lot of our coworkers overseas want to go home friday early just like we do um they can go into Slack or Teams or Mattermost or whatever they have and put in what they did, what they accomplished, any issues that came up, and leave us some notes, some bread crumbs, bread crumbs, so they can go home to their family and friends at a decent time on a Friday. They're not working late. I think that's an awesome idea. I think that builds the team. Now, how do you do this? One, you got to get buy-in from the team. Two, you got to set up your, your, your team norms. Your team norms should reflect this. Like whatever on Friday, on Fridays, we do daily scrum via Slack. There should be a line in the team norm. Friday, daily, uh, daily scrum via Slack or where everybody reports out. Why? Because it has an expectation that everybody goes home at a decent. It does two things. One, 
now as a scrum master I said look we're all going home early if we don't do this then we gotta eliminate and we gotta gotta call in and people aren't gonna be happy two it gets an agreement with the team and it's not you three it allows everybody to know that on fridays everybody's gonna go home early because that's why we're doing this on slack right um we may not have a full work day on it well we had a full work day we're just not making everybody max out their time like if they want to get some people want to get home early, go in the office early on a Friday so they can leave early because they want to go to the, have a longer weekend or they got some place to go. Or they got a place to go drive to. So that's my proposal. Have fun. <laughs> right. Um, I do it that way so that it's not a, it's not like, OK, this is what you don't want. And that's what I see a lot of teams do. And I think I agree with it. I think I was, uh, I went to a scrum talk and I had to figure out where it was now because I really want to give this person credit. And they were talking about retrospectives or, or meetings. It's either all remote or it's all local. You can't do half because it's the, the, the um, evenness and the equal opportunity across the team doesn't exist. And the more and more I think about it, the more and more it resonates in my brain, the more and more I totally agree. So what you don't do is like say, OK, well, we'll have everybody in India um, do Slack or offshore or wherever you are in the other continents or whatever. We'll have them do Slack, but we'll still meet in person. No, the idea is that everybody is in the same boat when it comes to daily scrum. That way everybody knows what it's like to do it, what it's like to receive the information on the other side in whatever format or non-format that you give. So what you don't want to do is say, okay, well, all the offshore people can do daily scrum via Slack, but all the onshore people are still going to meet in person. No, you don't want to do that because now it sets up an us and them mentality. Either all do Slack for Daily Scrum on a Friday or none do Slack for Daily Scrum on a Sunday. I mean, on Friday. Did I say Sunday? I meant Friday. It's Sunday. It's early. Um, but that's my proposal. I hope you like it. Uh, I actually think it's probably, I think it's a good one, you know. All the uh, scrum perfectionists out there might disagree with what I have to say, but I think people need to get home and enjoy their weekends and get the heck out of the office, even if their office is their cave in their house right now with the coronavirus. I think it makes sense. Anyway, that's pretty much all I have for today, just the one topic. And... Uh, I want to say thank you all. Thank you all for a year plus of helping grow the channel for me to learn so much about um, YouTube and social media. And we're going to keep going. But, you know, it's been a pretty good thing. It's I learned a lot about it. I was talking to someone about why, you know, why I do things. And I'm like, I do a lot of it so I can learn how this thing works, man. And what it really takes to do social media. Because you never know. I might do some agile coaching for a marketing firm. You know, I think marketing really could use some agile experience. So with that, I'm going to say goodbye. Have a good day. Enjoy your day. Have some fun. Enjoy your Sunday. Some of the people, when you wake up or you're, you're closing down for the day, right? You're closing. Your Sunday's coming to an end. You got your work starting on Monday. I wish you good luck tomorrow morning. And uh, enjoy your family and friends for whatever left in the weekend. And let's see. We got 25 seconds. Let's see. Because I found that if I do 10 minutes, I can control what goes on YouTube a little bit better than I can under 10 minutes. It's funny how they have this. If it's over 10 minutes, you can control what we do. If it's not over 10 minutes, you cannot control. We will do what we want to do. So now I'm just delaying, I think. I don't know. Got to get my hair cut, though. I say that every day. And um, yeah, that's it.
happy scrumming. Take care. And uh, debating whether I want to put stuff about YouTube, social media, and a channel on what I had to do that, to do all this stuff one day. I mean, I could do that. I know it gets a lot of uh, visitors on that, but it's not necessarily why we're doing this channel. But the cool thing is on YouTube is that even though I'm doing this thing really early in the morning, you can play at any time, anywhere, anywhere, anywhere in the world once it's in YouTube. That's one of the coolest things about YouTube. All right. Y'all take care. Have a great day. Enjoy. Have fun. Bye. Take Fridays off from Scrum. No daily Scrum on Friday.